All right, guys, Dave Wersch here. Don't forget to subscribe on the Dave Wersch channel. Hey, today we are going out to Pine Island uh, Marina, uh, Pine Land Marina, and we're gonna venture out, maybe Boca Grande, go out in the Gulf. Uh, right now it's very smooth, so please stay tuned to the channel and hopefully you enjoy the trip. Thank you again, please subscribe. Hey, uh, just to let you know, we stopped here for a moment. This is Yusef Island right here. Uh, you can only get here by uh, boat. Uh, the hurricane rolled right through here. And surprisingly, uh, the houses look pretty good. They must have uh, fixed them up. Uh, but the only way to get to this island is by boat anyway. Uh, so you can't drive a car to Yusef Islands. If you want to take vacation, uh, right here is a great spot, Yusef Island. So uh, we're going to continue on. Uh, we're out in the uh, intercoastal waterway right here, and there's an opening right there, and Boca Grande down there. Alright guys, we are at Cabbage Key. Uh, Jimmy Buffett made this place kind of famous. Uh, cheeseburger Paradise supposedly is the song. But uh, the, hurricane rolled th the hurricane rolled through here, but... Seems uh, it's pretty good. This here is Cabbage Key, and here there is a restaurant, a bar. You can walk around, look at the tower. Uh, they have turtle. Uh, they have all kinds of stuff. Uh, but mainly everything was closed. Uh, we're not entering this spot. There's Cabbage Key, the restaurant. Uh, there's a Category 5 hurricane that rolled in here. And uh, it's amazing, but all the buildings are all intact. Uh, yeah, I know, the turtles, well, they can always hide somewhere in underground or around something, but who knows. But uh, everything seems to be uh, in shape. The ferry usually comes in here. And uh, sometimes we tie up. Uh, the docks are gone here. We always just hang out, but uh, we're hanging out here in the opening of Boca Grande. Uh, this is one of the deepest areas here in the water. Uh, it's like 90 or 80 feet deep in some parts. But the hurricane rolled in, so we're not sure. The stuff moved around the bottom, the sand moved around, big new shoals. But uh, we're out here in the opening because uh, it's the time of the year where they have. Uh, well, the tarpon have come in, and if you look over here, these people here are all fishing for the tarpon. Because uh, the mullet have come in, this is about the Grand Lighthouse right there. And they're all the fishermen, they're, uh, they're trolling, uh, they're throwing out mullet. Uh, mullet out there, live mullet, some crabs, uh, maybe shrimp. Sometimes you can see the tarpon uh, roll on top of the water. So uh, we haven't seen anybody catch anything yet, uh, but just to let you know, we are in the opening. This is a gulf. Kaya Costa, island of Kaya Costa here. We set up our tent. Mila's excited, ready to go. We're gonna go have lunch. Uh, we got the jet ski tied up out here. This is the Gulf. All of this is a Gulf. This is uh, Boca Grande where all the people were fishing. And uh, that is north and that is south. Like you want to go to Sanibel and, and um, what do you call it? Uh, Fort Myers and stuff like that. But it is a beautiful day. The water's not bad. I already jumped in. It's got to be 70 something, 73, 74, maybe more. I'm not uh, flinching. And, uh, but one thing is, usually this time of year, the water's really blue, but we did have a hurricane uh, roll in and uh, completely destroy, uh, moved a bunch of sand and uh, made shoals. So people are scared to go boating, some, some of them are, uh, because all of a sudden you're in a channel and it's uh, a foot deep because of the uh, hurricane just moved all the sand. So they're in the process of opening the channels. So, uh, we're gonna have lunch now, and uh, 
maybe play some uh, smash ball a little bit. Uh, we got a good spot, and uh, the wind is coming uh, from that direction, which is uh, east. We got east wind. We got the trees up here blocking everything, so we don't get hit with any wind. And uh, I didn't bring my little anchor uh, to screw into the ground to hold uh, the back of the boat. Oop. Screw in back of the boat here. So I did find a piece of wood. It's working just fine. So. Okay, guys, uh, I'm at Kaya Costa State Park. Well, it uh, looks like uh, the park is closed. We had the hurricane. Uh, looks like uh, everything, they had uh, docks and stuff for the boats to come in. It uh, looks like those are gone. You can also camp. They have camping spots. Uh, I think those are gone or closed. And then they had the restroom. Uh, bathroom over there. I think that's completely destroyed. And uh, here's the uh, little sign of the birds of the flock. Uh, uh, the different type of uh, different type of birds. So we will not be able to go any forward far uh, further. Sorry about that, but if you're headed to Kaya Costa and you want to take a tour, uh, now is not the time. So, if you got a boat, you're welcome. You can go here, what you can. But it uh, looks like the tour boats are hurting this year because uh, the tour boats will take you over here uh, to the island. So, that's why boat sales were huge out here. We had Kovic, so everybody was on their boats. And now we had the hurricane, so... Uh, the marinas are all devastated, so the one or two marinas that are open are are um, crowded, very crowded. And uh, that's it. Headed back to the water. Uh, sorry about, uh, this has been about seven months since the hurricane rolled in. Uh, we're still trying to recover. Everything's been devastated. They're trying to rezone a bunch of houses and buildings and people are a little upset because they're going to lose all their their partial houses and stuff. So, all right. I'll just get whatever I can get. Okay, let's go. Alright guys, uh, looks like we got to pack up. It's 310. We had a great day on uh, Kaya Costa. And uh, we're packing up, ready to go.